Hello, my name is Eric York, Director of New Product Development for NTS Solar. I'm here today to show you a new generation of vacuum tube technology. Uh, these vacuum tubes we, we manufacture in Germany. Uh, we do a couple of different things than what you see out in the market. We do a glass to metal seal, which you'll see here, which guarantees vacuum for 10 years. We also coat the inside and outside of the glass with an anti-reflective coating, which keep, makes sure that we keep hold of 96% of the sunlight that enters the tube. We also coat the absorber with a compound known as Tynox that allows us to hold to capture 96% of the sunlight that touches the Tynox. The stagnation temperature or the peak temperature of the tube is 565 Fahrenheit or 300 centigrade. What you see behind me is one of our latest collectors known as the S-Power collector uh, that, that comes in 10 20 and 30 tube models. Uh, they are The tubes are coated both sides. If you happen to put a white or a mirror behind it, you'll actually get 30% more out of the collector, making it nearly 99% efficient. Uh, by doing so, uh, this, you'll be able to have more roof space for other things such as green roofs, photovoltaics, wind, or maybe even your lawn chair. Um, the, these will be installed and look near nearly um, seamless as you put them together just by how we connect them. They look nearly seamless by how we connect them together um, when you put them in, into large arrays. Uh, we, we, right now we're targeting industrial commercial but we also do residential as well. We're able to get nearly 48,000 in Boston, 48,000 BTUs out of any one collector in a, in a given day. Um, we also have other models um, that you that are here as well that are smaller they come in different sizes 0.8 meter 1.5 meter and 2 meter uh, and by do, by doing that we're able to come up with a line of collectors instead of always trying to fit one collector into any installation we're able to give you architectural type looks we're able to fit around dormers put them in tight spaces